the Directors' Cup Measures Division I program success over a broad complement of fall, winter and spring collegiate sports, with points awarded on the basis of NCAA championship finishes. Boosted by first and second place finishes in men's and women's NCAA gymnastics, respectively, the Sooners advanced 54 spots in the Directors' Cup standings through the winter sports season. Oklahoma was 83rd in the standings after the fall sports season, with all 85 points being awarded for the Sooners' number 3 final ranking in football. OU accumulated an additional 331.50 points in winter sports, with points awarded in men's and women's basketball, men's and women's gymnastics and men's and women's indoor track and field. The Sooners' cumulative point total through April is 416.50, with points still outstanding and likely in several spring sports, softball, baseball and golf. More from Storman in Norman, Oklahoma finished 17th in the final Directors' Cup standings for 2016-17, with 876 total points, and was 16th the year before, with 914.25 points. Among the Big 12 schools, Texas leads the conference, currently ranked number 8 in the Directors' Cup standings through the winter sports season. Oklahoma State is 36th, West Virginia 39th, Iowa State 42nd, TCU 57th, Baylor 62nd, Kansas 65th, Kansas State 84th and Texas Tech 99th. Stanford, which ranks no. 1 in the current standings, has finished first in the Directors' Cup for 22 consecutive years, by far the most of any NCAA Division I school. The Cardinal have won at least one NCAA team championship in 41 consecutive years. Penn State is second in the current standings, followed by Michigan, Ohio State, North Carolina State, Notre Dame, Minnesota, Texas, UCLA and Florida. North Carolina finished in first the very first year of the Directors' Cup in 1993-94. Stanford has won every year since. The highest finish for a Big 12 school is second. Texas did that three times. The highest Oklahoma has finished is seventh in 2012-13.